When you start to get excited about the goal or ambition, does the thought, I'm too old, ever come in and stop you in your tracks? I'm Jenny Clift and I work with musicians, stage artists and creatives of all kinds to help them uncover and heal limiting beliefs and other things that really hold them back. In a recent event that I ran called Break Through Your Limitations, um, this thought, I'm too old, came up for so many people, from a 27-year-old singer to a violinist who said she's been feeling this since she was 13. And it's quickly followed by other beliefs like, what's the point? It's too late anyway. I missed the boat. I should have done things years ago. Chances are, if you're watching this, this thought has also plagued you and you're serious about getting rid of it. So join me right now for a little bit of EFT tapping and let's see if we can create some momentum, get some shifts happening and be able to start taking actions to follow your dreams. So if you're ready, just take a moment to close your eyes. We're just gonna go inside just for a minute and feel centered and grounded. So just take a deep breath and let it go. And just drop down into your body, feeling where you're touching your chair, wherever you're sitting. Make sure you're not driving. Um, and just say out loud if possible, or just in your own, own mind, I'm too old. So thinking about something you want to do, something you want to achieve. And how true does that belief feel to you? Um, on a scale of one to 10, so one being, no, that's not true at all. 10 being, yeah, absolutely, completely stuck. And how does that make you feel? Words in this group, when I work with them, this words like hopeless or resigned or sad or even angry came up. Again, just rating those beliefs on a scale of one to 10. And when you're ready, take another deep breath, let it go and open your eyes and let's do some tapping together. So we're going to start on the side of the hand. Remember just um, repeating back with me, tapping on the points and just be just one word of yeah, caution. If you know you've got some really heavy stuff around this, maybe reach out to someone who know that someone's supporting you. And um, but for everyone else, Let's tap together and see what shifts we can take to start make happen. Even though I'm too old, so you repeat back, I love and accept myself completely. Even though I'm too old to follow this dream, I love and honor myself completely. Even though I'm just too old, and I feel such a sense of resignation. I've just left it too late. There's nothing to be done. And I deeply and completely love, honor and accept myself. Okay, go around the points. I'm too old. I'm too old. And I hate saying these words out loud, but I've been saying them to myself for so long and they really hold me back. I feel so hopeless because we live in the real world. There is a time space continuum there are limits to what we can do. And a part of me really believes that I've reached my limit and there's nothing to be done. So I completely give up and I feel so much hopelessness and so much heaviness all this sadness and heavy energy in my body. Because I think about it so much. This thing that I want to do, this goal that I want to achieve, 
and I left it too late. I miss the boat. All these depressing things that I think and all these feelings. I'm really feeling them now and that doesn't feel good. But what if this is something I could do? Perhaps I was always taught that there was just one path. And if you didn't follow that path, that one way of doing things in the exact right amount of time, then you'd missed your chance. And what if it just wasn't true? What if there were still things I could do? If I could raise my energy and start to get creative and find ways to at least follow a little bit of my dream. Because I can't see into the future. I can't see all the possibilities. Right now, my thinking is very limited. So I get into this stuck record of I'm too old. Why bother? And it's exhausting. And I choose to clear this. And I choose to allow myself to know that if I was going to follow this dream, what would be the next step? Just that. I'm not going to go off into the future and scare myself silly. I'm just going to think about one step. The next step. And what I could do today. And if I do one step every day for the next year, I'll be 365 steps ahead in the direction of my dream. And everything will look so different. Everything will be so different. So I'm clearing this energy clearing the emotions which have been keeping me safe because maybe it's time to do this now. The things that my soul wants me to do. And I choose to feel really good. Really good about myself and really good about my dream as I focus on this next step. So just stop tapping, take a deep breath and let it go. And just feel into your body, into your, into your emotions, how that feels. And I'd love you to share that next step that you're gonna take in the comments below and how you're feeling, how you felt before and after the tapping. And if you want any more information about my EFT energy performance coaching, just have a look at the link below and you'll get more information there. Thanks for watching and go shine your light.